So let me just share this out and then I'll get started on my puzzle piece. I'm not doing the great big one because it takes a long time to dry and I know you guys don't want to sit here to watch me dry. So I'm just going to do the medium sized one. But let me share this out really quick. I don't know, I'm just in a mood today. I feel like, you know, crafting quite a bit today. I'm going to go to um, Hobby Lobby later, I think. I think. And Michael's, possibly. All right, I just shared it in a couple places. That'll be good. Normally, I would use my last two big puzzle pieces that I have. I would do the big one, but it, it takes too long to dry one live. So I decided to do this one. To use the medium size one, I'm going to do this one. Need to just sew it first. <laughs> oh, hi. Oh, you were? Oh, it's, oh, Jeanette? Oh, okay. Yeah. I decided to go live again, and I wanted to do another puzzle piece. Not my great big one, but um, I have two of these left and two of the great big ones left, so I'm on a addiction of the puzzle pieces right now so i've been having a blast with them i'm using heavy gesso just so it, it just a nice thick coverage and it's going to hold everything really good i'm going to use some different types of little rocks this time different ones um each of my new puzzle pieces that I've been doing, um, I've been using different types of textures to see how they hold up with what I'm doing to the puzzles. So far, they've all been really nice. Well, I like them, and everybody else, I guess, has been liking them. I mean, I've been getting a lot of comments and things like that on them. So the last thing to do with them, though, when I do go to hang them up, is i got to apply something to the back of them to hang them up. And again, I have four dogs, and right now they're outside. Well, two of them are. So when they come back in, if they get loud, I will quiet them down. But please uh, forgive me for the noise if they come in and be loud. They're hyper today. They must sense that I'm, that I'm in a really good mood and that I'm feeling good. So they, too, are probably feeling good. And um, while I'm using my heat gun, if at all it doesn't quiet down, please let me know. Because, you know, I know you guys don't want to listen to a loud heat gun. But from from what I understand, it, it gets quiet after a few seconds. So, all right, that looks like it's pretty good.
Oh, thank you, Jeanette. Thank you very much. Whenever, um, when I get uh, either a she shed or uh, my own crafting room, you know, I'm going to hang them up in there. Um, well, depending on what I, I may get rid of in my auctions or um, sell or, you know, whatnot. Um, uh, I will save some of my favorites to hang in my craft room, definitely. Just to always remind myself of the inspiration I had when I did them. So I'm going to use, I think, my white texture paste again, if I can reach it. And then I found these little bitty rocks. They're not quite as clear as the little clear bead things I had, but um, they're small, lightweight, and they're like uh, transparent. So I'm going to try these for my texture. And, um, okay, my dogs are coming in now, so hopefully they're quiet. So first I get some, oh, focus there. Come on, focus. Um. Hopefully it gives me some nice look, some nice good texture look. Get some texture paste on here. I mean, it doesn't have to be too thick, otherwise you're gonna be drying forever, but you need enough for everything to stick. Let's we'll see how good that is. Then I'm just going to sprinkle some of these little pebbles all over it. And I know it, it seems pretty, it is pretty simple actually. Um, you know, and all, all it comes down to is just getting them on here, letting them dry and then um, coloring them. That's the, that's the fun part, you know, getting to color them and see what you come up with, how it's going to look. It's really simple. I mean, it's just a, a few steps that takes a little time, but it, it's really fun. I think it is anyways. Something fun to do. I think I pulled just enough texture paste out for this one. Shouldn't take too long to dry. While I am drying it, 
you can step away or do whatever you'd like. Um, because it's going to take a few minutes to dry. I wish I can just fast forward this all while we're while I'm drying it, but it won't take too long. Hi, Earth Gal. Oh, really? Uh yeah, a good friend of mine uh, that crabs, her son is um, autistic as well, and he absolutely loves crafting artwork of all kinds. And he's really good at what he does, too. Oh, I might need that. So I'm just going to take some of these and I'm just going to start sprinkling them on there. All over the place. It might be a little bit easier to do this. I'll, I'll get some on and off of it, but we'll, I'll pick them up and save what I don't use. I mean, obviously it does make the puzzle piece a little heavier, but not much. But the colors that just drizzle down, it's just so beautiful. Let's see. All right, let's get to drawing this. Again, it's just going to take me a few moments, well, a few minutes or so to dry this. Um, so you can do whatever and, and uh, come back or whatever. Or I can sit and chat with you. And um, it'll probably be, probably be dry before you know it. And then we can start to add some color. You'll see some of them starting to move. Some won't stick, but most will. 95% of them will stick. But there, see, there's a few that's going to come off.
my first puzzle pieces I did, I was just using the stencils. I would, um, you know, run some texture paste through a stencil and it would give a cool, really cool effect as well. But I'm like, no, there's got to be more I can do to this with texture. And then I just started thinking about other things to use for texture. Uh, when I go into the craft store, I would only go in there looking for things to use for texture. And that's when I came up with um, these little rocks and things like that. I'm, I um, only, only got partway through the store and I already found the texture I wanted. So I'm... I'm not even done yet. I can go through and still find more. I know I can. Yes, I'm back on. I'm having such a wonderful day. I wanted to come craft some more. I'm, I'm altering a little puzzle piece. Not a great big one this time, but a smaller one. Hi, Yvonne. How are you? I'm just uh, drawing this and then we're going to add the color and uh, make it look cool. It's just going to take a few moments to dry this. In just a little bit, um, I'm going to lift it up and see what pebbles are going to fall off. That way I kind of get an idea if I need to add more or not, but usually not. Hi, Carla. Good morning. Hi, everyone. This will be drying in just a few moments. I really wish I can just speed this drawing up, but I can't. You know, I thought about just making a video, but I, I really just wanted to come on live and craft and chat a little bit, but... Oh, no way. Ken it's Kennedy's birthday. Oh, my goodness. Happy birthday, Kennedy. Oh, the big two. Oh, wow. Happy birthday. Aw, oh, thanks, Carla. I appreciate that. I know I haven't been able to go live as much, you know, because I do live in my RV. And, you know, when my husband's here, you know, and watches TV and stuff, I can't go live because, of, you know, the noise in the background. But sometimes, you know, he'll just say, you know, go ahead or make a video or something, you know, he doesn't mind. Or he's, like right now he's out doing his hobby. He's playing with his RC cars. Um, he's got a lot of money invested in those things, and now that the weather is cooling off, he can play with them um, because, you know, they have motors and things like that, and then you can't really play with them in the summertime because uh, they will overheat and the motors will blow. So now that we're cooling off, he can actually take them out. Oh, it's been you. Oh, gosh, it's been me, too. <laughs>
And plus, a while back, I used to be a, a night owl, and I would go on only late at night, you know, and now I my sleeping schedule is back normal, where I sleep at night and I'm awake during the day, so I can actually, you know, see people, because it, it was bad. I was awake, you know, from midnight till late in the morning, and that, that's just not good hours. I, I, you know, I don't get to visit with nobody. Hi, Joe. Yes, I'm back at it. <laughs> what you up to, lady? Hubby done left me, went to go play with his RC car, so I decided I was going to go live again and just play with another puzzle piece. I am going to uh, tip it and see how much falls off. I know some's going to, but hopefully we don't lose too much. There we go. Ooh, and those suckers are hot. Let's tap it some more. I think that's about all we're going to lose. Maybe one or two here and there, but that's about it. Oh, you're a night out? Well, I've been able to start staying up till almost midnight now, but anything past midnight, I'm done. I can't do it. <laughs> All right, I gotta continue to dry some more, but it is almost done. And then we get to add color. Because uh, it, the little rocks and the pebbles kind of speed up the drying time on the texture paste because those things get really hot. You know what I mean? And, and uh, so it kind of speeds up the drying time a little bit. But I'm, I'm going to go to um, Hobby Lobby later and Michael's. And the main thing I'm going to do when I go to Hobby Lobby is I'm going to look for things to use for texture. It's going to be all about texture when I go to Hobby Lobby. Oh, you! Oh boy. Oh, I'm excited, Joe. I'm excited. I can't wait. On my last one, I used transparent inks, but this one I'm not. I'm going to use like um, acrylic permanent inks to see what kind of look it gives with these kind of rocks. Well, hello, Kathleen. Welcome. Thank you for coming over. Oh, no, I buy these at Hobby Lobby. There's like four different sizes. They're very small, and then a smaller one, then a medium, and then a real large one. I, if you saw my pictures on uh, Pink Poodle or in my, in my group, there's really, well, <laughs> well, see the size I'm doing now? This is the biggest one there is. <laughs> I've done two of these size now. Um, my, um, home address, Kathleen? Sure. Yeah. 
sure. I'll send it to you. I'll get it to you right now while I'm um, drying this because it's not like I can do anything else really. <laughs> And there you go. Yeah, it's like in the wood section over by where, like, you'll find their words that are cut out, you know, or um, just, you know, their wood section where you, all the wood stuff. Kind of by where, right here where all their glass um, containers are. Yes, they're hobby boards. You're welcome. So I hit um, 600 subscribers. I'm, well, I'm actually at 641 now. And when I get to 700, I'm going to do a big giveaway. Um, and then at a thousand, I'm going to do an even bigger giveaway. So there'll be a giveaway at 700, and then there'll be a really big giveaway once I hit a thousand. I'm not going to do eight or 900. I'm going to wait and do a thousand. Because it's going to be extra special once I hit a thousand. And I know I can do it. I know I can. Hi, Irina. How are you? It's been a long time. Thank you, Yvonne. And it's just about drying. We can add color in just a moment. <laughs> Whatever that means. <laughs> Did you, Kathleen? Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm glad that you said that because, see, there's another person. There's two people, Kathleen, and you're one of them, obviously. I don't know because when I went through all my craft stuff, little paper pad that I had written everything on, for the life of me, I cannot find a little paper pad. I was cleaning through all my craft supplies, and there's two people that won stencils for me to make. And I only got two, uh, there was four, I mean, and only two got sent out. The other two were on that pad of paper, and I only did two. So you must be one of them. Oh, I will definitely get on to that, Kathleen. I just don't, I hope I can run into the other person that I owe stencils to. Um, you know, and hopefully they'll come out and say, hey, it was me or whatever, you know, and not feel like, you know, should I say something or should, should I not? So please do, because it doesn't take anything for me to make the stencil. I just got to bring my cricket down and then uh, punch in a few buttons and then let it cut. And then, you know, just mail them. Oh, thank you for telling me, Kathleen. Oh, I appreciate that. 
now I'm putting notes in my computer instead of writing things down. Well, God forbid my computer crashes, right? But I'm putting notes into my computer now, my laptop, instead of just writing things down. Because, you know, all the time, throw things away. You No, you're joking, right, Arita? Are you serious? There's no way that the... Oh my gosh. I from MMM, huh, Irina? Oh man. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Give me okay. I'm gonna let this sit cool off, and then maybe it's dry. Let me write. While that's cooling down a bit, I'm gonna write a note in my laptop right now. Because if I don't do it right now, I will forget later. I definitely will forget. Okay. Oh, thank you. This is, it's too funny. I really think it's just too funny that you both are in here right now. I thought you were kidding, Irina. And then I see, sometimes I forget, but when a person tells me something, it kind of triggers the memory or, you know what I mean? Like it'll, it'll trigger of what, why or when, or, and now I'm thinking it was a mixed media mashup. I'm thinking it was for your arena. It could have been for you too, Kathleen, but I haven't done giveaways in a while. So I just, um, oh, well, I did one for another channel not too long ago, but oh, it's wow. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool, ladies. I've got my note written down, and I'll do that probably a little later. Yay! Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, I'm I'm happy because I'm like, I knew there was two people left, and I was like, this was a you know, this was a long while ago. This is like over three weeks ago, and I'm like. You know, I wonder what those two people are thinking. You know, I wonder, you know, they think I'm a flake or something like that, you know, and and it's just too weird that you both are in here together. And then one mentions it and then you're like, I'm the other. <laughs> I love it. Thank you very much. Please, any of you that are here, if if you ever want anything from me and it seems like because usually, uh, hi peddlers medley. Um, usually, when I um, people buy things or they win something, I usually get it shipped out within two to three days. Usually, always. Um, sometimes the very next day. So if it feels like it's gone too long and you haven't gotten your giveaway yet, just tell me. Hey, Teresa, did you forget? Or I just um, I'm I've gone through a lot. Oh yeah, they're dry. I've gone through a lot these past six months, so my memory has been kind of crazy. But it's getting it's getting a lot better, I believe. Yeah, I think it's dry enough. So we are going to color this bad boy. Oh, your name is Sean. Oh, that's my hubby's name. I won't forget that name. But you spell yours different than mine. My husband. His is S H A W N. All right, so we're going to tilt it up like this. And I think you guys, let's see. Okay. And I think you guys can still see it while I color it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some of the FW inks and uh, my water bottle. i got to dry each layer pretty much because um, I don't want it to mix too bad. But I'm going to start with a light color first and work my way to darker colors. I'm going to try to only work with, <laughs> you don't hold it against him. <laughs> no, his mom. You can hold it against his mom. <laughs> I am going to start with this um, 
what color is this? Uh, sky blue, light blue sky or whatever. That is too amazing. God was like saying, hey, you wanted to know who those two ladies were that won stencils? Well, I'm going to bring them to you both right now. Right now. And figures. It's a little bit clogged. So hang on. Oh, shoot. I cannot answer right now. I don't know who it is, but I can't answer right now. Sorry. There we go. I'm going to try to just work. I want blue and green. But I don't know. We'll see if it stays that way. Yeah, really, right? Uh, the texture is just little clear white pebbles. Well, that didn't make sense. Little clear white pebbles. They're just little clear, um, like transparent pebbles. <laughs> yeah, God, that did not make sense. I'm losing it. Losing it. Okay, that's all the light blue I'm going to add. I just dry it for a little bit just so the color will set in and then I can add my next color. Thank you, Sean. I wonder if I say that enough. I wonder if I say that enough. Thank you, Sean. <laughs> My husband probably wouldn't agree with that. Oh, and I think my hubby's home. That's okay. He'll be quiet. He's going to put all his little cars away. Oh, no, that's not him. He has the RC car hobby. Uh, I do, too, but I don't play with those as much as I craft. I have some really cool big 4x4 four four trucks that are RC cars, and I have um, little, little ones, medium ones, big ones. You know, not the little tiny RC cars that you get from, like, Walmart on they actually come from the hobby shop. They're pretty good. They're fun to play with. But I think I can get into my next color now.
that's what people have been saying that YouTube hasn't been sending out none of my notifications. I don't know why, but you're like the fourth person today, Irina, that's told me that. So I'm not sure what's going on. I really don't know. Okay, I'm going to add now some turquoise green. I'm not sure if I want to do it or not yet, but you know, when it's towards the end of this, I may use the metallic lusters on this too. I'm not sure yet though. All right, I gotta dry again that color and then we'll add another color. Oh, I know, I live right off the main highway or, you know, main road in our town. So we constantly hear sirens, constantly. Oh, there goes another one. Oh, I'm going to Michael's so today. Got a coupon for 20% off. 50. Oh, ooh, cool. I'm going there today. So have fun. I hope you find some good stuff. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I noticed, though, towards Christmas time, uh, you know, through the basically fall and winter, I guess, that Michael's, they have like a 50, uh, either a 40 to 60 percent off almost every two weeks before the holidays. $20 off when you spend 50. Okay. So if I spend 50 bucks, I'll really only spend 30. That's cool. Nice. That's cool. Thank you for telling me that. Now I'm going to use um, Bombay ink, uh, the color aqua. And I'm not going to squirt water this time. I'm going to just try it this way. Okay, you have a wonderful day, Sean, and um, I'll post pictures if you go into Pink Poodle Crafts. 
I'll post pictures there of it later. Now there's people driving like a maniac out there, it sounds like. You have a wonderful day. Don't work too hard. And then the next color I'm going to use is... um. Well, it says turquoise, but it looks a lot darker than turquoise. And you know what, Irina and Kathleen, uh, I'm sorry. You know, I should have been more responsible about things than that. And I'm truly sorry. I, I promise, you know, your um, your package will be worth the wait, okay? Um, these inks are um, Dr. P.H. Martin's uh, Bombay ink. And then the iridescent. And then another one is uh, Amsterdam ink. And then another one is Daler Rowney FW ink. All right, we're going to use this Bombay. It says turquoise, but it sure doesn't look like turquoise to me. Oh, I understand. I, I appreciate that. But, you know, I like to fulfill. Everybody likes to get their giveaways, you know. Um, you know, when you're told you're going to get something, you know, you have a feeling of expecting it, you know. It's something you won. I'm, I'm so thankful that you told me. Well, I guess it could be a turquoise. It just looks a little darker in the bottle. Next, I'm going to add some jade, iridescent jade.
this is the color I'm going to add next, but it's iridescent. You won't really see a difference except the sheen of it. And then after that, the last color will be the iridescent blue. Thanks, Yvonne. I'm hoping you guys can kind of see a little bit how it's looking right now, but definitely when I lay it flat, you'll be able to see it much better. Thank you. get ready to add this um, jade. I think jade is a very pretty color. Oh, really? Yeah, they're like, it's like, I guess, ocean colors or something like that. Let me make sure the jade works okay. Oh, you do see the sheen. I guess when I turn it flat or make it go flat, you guys will be able to see the sheen much better. All right, give this a dry, and then we're going to put our last color on. Oh, wow, that sounds like it was really pretty. Okay, I'm going to add the uh, iridescent blue. Another car racing by.
little bit right there. Okay, that's going to be it for the color. All right, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to move. The, I still need to dry it a little bit more, but I'm going to lay it flat. Here, I'll do a, uh, let's see if the camera will focus. I don't think it's going to focus. Come on, focus, camera. not focusing really well oh really oh jade is beautiful three little rocks didn't make it sorry you guys you didn't make it you didn't make the cut all right let's finish drawing this So I've decided I do want to use the metallic lusters. I'm going to use my cosmic blue and my brilliant turquoise. Thank you, my fa my fashion brand TV. How are you? Welcome. You like what you see and you want to come back um, to another one of my live streams, uh, hit that subscribe button, please. I'm trying my hardest to get up to a thousand. Well, no, I haven't been trying my hardest. I take that back. I've, I've been trying, but not my hardest. Not that anything's going to happen when I hit a thousand, except a good giveaway. But it would just be nice if I can get to a thousand. Maybe I can do um, my paint pours outside on a big canvas. You know, I can stream on my phone and do a paint pour outside. Where I, I can do some inside, but only on little canvases right here. But I'd love to do a big canvas outside on my table. I think it's dry enough that I can put some metallic luster on and then give a quick dry after those. And then I'm going to put a word on there. You know, 
I'm so used to using this. I really like using this, so I'm going to bring it back. It just makes things a bit easier so I can move it around on here. I'm going to do the cosmic blue first. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, I'm losing a couple rocks. That's okay because it's still a bit wet. But I'll finish drying. I got to be easy, but I'll finish drying it. Hi, Keisha. How are you? Thank you, everybody who's come in to say hi. I appreciate it. I'm having a wonderful crafting Saturday. And then I've been, this is my second time live today. And then I get to go to the craft stores a little bit later on. So it, it's a good day. Thank you very much. Now I'm going to do my edges black, but I don't know if I can do that till it's totally dry. To be able to hold it really good to do the edges, you know, I want to make sure it's completely dry. Oh boy, you got some goodies. Oh, Tuesday morning is right by the Michaels. So I may have to go there too. <laughs> just to, you know, just to see if they got anything. I mean, anything in there that I could possibly get. All right. Let me blast this with some heat for a minute. Then I'm going to find that other word I want to, or a word that I'm going to use. I think it's going to be another glass word or a mirror. I'm sorry. It's a little words that are mirrors on. You'll see. Uh, I, if you saw my other one, you'll see. Thank you, Kathleen. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for liking my work. I'm still learning. I love learn. I love the learning process. You get to try all new kinds of things to see what works and what doesn't work and. I'm having a lot of fun, you know, doing this ever since the last three years now. This is my third year crafting, and I, I'm telling you, it just keeps getting better and better. Aw, thank you very much.
Okay, let me grab my words. Oh, I still have a few left. I have hello. I've used hello. I've never used friends. I just don't know if friends is the right one. But after all of you are in here today and being so kind and giving me compliments, maybe I'll use friends. I used joy today on one. Um, I have love. And friends and hello. I've used a hello. Wonder if it should be love or just friends. I wonder if friends will fit. <laughs> the price may go up next year. <laughs> All right, let's see if friends will fit, anyways. Because I've made quite a few friends. Well, let's see. If I did friends, I would make it like that. What do you guys think? Would friends look good just like that? Well, wait, i got to have it over just a bit so it all sticks on there. What do you think about that? Okay, then friends it is. It is a sticker, but I don't trust it, so I'm going to add my weld bond. I'm a lefty. And this glue dries clear, so it'll be all right. So I'm using the word friends because all of you have been very kind, to, very kind to me as friends would be to one another. So I appreciate that very much, you guys. I'm going to take this for just a second. Just for a second. Lay that on there. Oh, you're a lefty too? Oh, yay. Oh, Keisha, you're left. <laughs> yay. I only know one other person that was left-handed, and that was my cousin. So that is awesome, too. <laughs> Two I've met right now. Nice. I love it. See, um, this is just too much for me. I'm having too much fun. Is this, is this allowed? This isn't illegal for one person to have a... So much fun in one day. Yes, I love left or right-handed, but I don't meet very many left-handed people at all. I'm going to try one more time to see if I can bring this up close. If the camera will focus. Please focus, camera.
Thank you, Kathleen. Yes, I'm having a wonderful day. So there it is. It didn't see if I would have done that huge puzzle piece, I'd still be drying and drying and drying. But there it is. Now I, I really have to let it set before I can wrap it up and um, put it in a plastic or a clear bag. I have to actually let it sit for a couple hours. Um, and But I'm going to do the edges black. So I'll post pictures of it after I do the edges black. I'm just going to take my little sponge. I'm going to darken the edges black around the sides. Thank you very much. Oh, thanks, Yvonne. Oh, all of you. Wonderful. I love it. But I'm going to share the live streaming world. And I'm going to let you ladies go and find someone else live that you might want to watch. And I'm going to get my stuff cleaned up. And um, I'm going to get ready to go to the craft stores. I appreciate you hanging out with me and watching me through this whole thing. Um, I don't know if I've ever really finished one whole project. I mean, it wasn't that hard to do, of course. But I, I finished the whole thing from beginning to end. Well, actually, I... Can't say that because I didn't do my edges yet, but th that's near no here or there, but still, it's done pretty much. So you all have a wonderful day. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I'm sure I'll be back soon to see you. Uh, not today, probably. If I am back live today, I'll be on another channel. Uh, it's probably going to be Tina's Crafty Life. I'll be on her channel later on. Um, but other than that, I will catch you all next time. Thanks again. Thank you, Keisha. Bye, everyone. We'll see you next time.